Yo, what's up? Welcome back to the Haunted Basement Studio. I'm your host, Triple B, Brent Bromberg, and we got some horror movie news right now. We are going to be talking Terrifier 3 from Screen Rant. So let's go to the website right now and let's read what it has to say. All right, man. We got an all new Terrifier 3 image revealing the first look at the return of Laura Lavera Siana in her wing costume. And in 2016, Terrifier came out. It gave us Art the Clown. And he was first introduced to us in All Hallows Eve. But the horror franchise didn't take off until the 2022 sequel, pitting the killer clown against an equal memorable heroine. After the second film in the series became a cult sensation, grossing $15 million on a budget of $25,000. Art the Clown and Sienna are both back for a rematch in the upcoming third franchise film. With the Terrifier 3 release date still months away, Sienna, actor Lavera, has given audience a taste of what's to come. Posting this behind the scenes image on Instagram story that shows her final girl back in costume and ready to battle the terrifying nemesis. Check out the image below, so let's check it out. Bam, there it is. Man, she looks just like she was in part two. Man, she is gorgeous, look at that. She's back, it says, hell yeah. So let's see what else it has to say about this. How Terrifier 3 will bring back Art the Clown and another franchise final girl. Hell yeah, dude. She's a badass final girl. Man, she's up there on my list just after that one movie. So Art the Clown met his demise in the blood-soaked ending of Terrifier 2 with Sienna returning from the dead and pitating his head off with the sword made by her father. It would seem difficult for Art to return from having his head cut off. But the movie's mid credit scene made quick work of any questions of how he might be resurrected. In the scene, original Terrifier, Final Girl Victoria, who is now living in a psychiatrical hospital, is literally giving birth to Art's the clown's head without his body attached. And that's how the first one, second one ended with uh, Veronica uh, giving birth to just Art's head. And as she's carrying his head, dude, it was absolutely crazy. It has yet to be seen how Terrifier 3 will give Art the Clown his body back. But when he is fully restored, because with behind the scene photos, it has been confirmed that indeed he has his body back but we don't know how Sienna will seemingly be ready for him the wild card is Veronica who is presumed to be on Art's side his alley because she literally birthed his head back into this world and the little pale girl retrieved his head but a twist always can be in store for Veronica as the director Damien Leone pulls out all the stops for the third installment of this cult classic hit slasher franchise. All right, man, let's bring it back in here. So are you guys excited about Terrifier 3 as much as I am? I know that the release date has not been given to us yet, but my sources tell me it's going to be in October. So let's just uh, get ready for that. And it could be the final installment of Terrifier. But again, I've heard that Damon Leone, the writer director, has so much that he wants to put into this movie that it could be a four hour movie. But he doesn't want to make another long movie like he did in Terrifier 2. Because Terrifier 2 was an anomaly with a runtime of two hours and 23 minutes long. And it worked for that but he doesn't want to make another long film like that. So he just might make a two-parter. This 
Terrifier 3 might be a two-parter, an hour and a half movie, and then part four, another hour and a half movie, and it can cut it all down. Man, I'm not sure if that's gonna happen, but just be prepared, it could happen. Uh, but let's just get so excited for part three, and tell me in the comment section below if you think that Art's gonna win or if Sion is gonna win in this one. Tell me if you think there's gonna be any crazy twist. Is Veronica gonna become supernatural? Because there is supernatural elements in this franchise now. Because Art did die in the second one. Sienna did die in the second one and they both came back to life. But Art came back without his body. <laughs> All right, man, so y'all hit that like button and that sub button right down there because I'm gonna be keeping you updated with all crazy new horror movie news and I do reviews and some scary stories on this channel in the haunted basement studio thank you all for joining me and you guys keep it hardcore horror <laughs>you again for joining me in Haunted Basement Studio and if you want to hit that sub button it's right there and if you want to watch my Terrifier 2 live review it's right there when it came out. Betas.